More money, less problems. This just in the Sports Center. Shohei Otani's $700 million contract calls for him to be paid only $2 million a year for the next 10 seasons, with $680 million deferred until the end of the deal. Sources confirmed to ESPN. This provides a huge discount for LA with a competitive balance tax or money owed by teams who go over the payroll threshold. Our baseball insider Jeff Passan joins us now for much more. Boy, was I following you on Twitter just trying to follow everything <laughs> with this contract, and it's unlike anything we've seen before, Jeff. What's been the reaction around baseball? I think, Christina, the best way to put it is that people are absolutely flabbergasted <laughs> and trying to figure out what the reason behind this deal is. Um, for Shohei Otani, it's, I mean, it's just the largest deferral imaginable. You know, a guy who on the open market we thought was going to be making 50 plus million dollars a year is going to be making two million dollars and granted he makes a lot of money off the field which allowed him to pursue and that's an important point here pursue a contract like this we we have to understand players are not just going to sign something because teams put it in front of them this is a dream contract for the dodgers an absolute dream contract it's 700 on paper otani will get 700 million when it's all said and done but the present day value of the contract is a fraction of that. And so they can go out and spend more money on players, bring in even more of a championship caliber team around Otani than they already have. And, you know, it seems like everyone here is happy. Otani gets to play with a team that's going to win. The Dodgers don't have to spend as much money. And the rest of baseball shudders at this idea that they see as circumvention of the competitive balance tax, but in reality is completely legal in the collective bargaining agreement that says you can defer as much money as you want. Yeah, so they're by the book, and either way, the savings for the Dodgers are massive. What a great way to start the relationship. But what does this mean for the team in the short term? <laughs> in the short term, it means... Uh, potentially, hello, Yoshinobu Yamamoto. Uh, hello, any other free agent out there? Perhaps Tyler Glasnow, Dylan Cease. The Dodgers have room to operate under the CBT threshold. And mind you, the, the reaction around baseball tonight has been like the Dodgers have had a $300 million payroll in the past. It's not like they need any help. But this is going to allow them at least $25 million extra compared to what his salary normally would be. Typically, the way that the competitive balance tax works, Christina, is that it's the average annual value of the contract. 10 years, $700 million. It should be $70 million a year. But because deferred money is discounted under the CBT, it's going to wind up closer to $46 million, which is going to keep the Dodgers uh, under for now and allow them to go out and spread their money to whoever they want. Yeah, I'm still scratching my head with this money. You describe it as flabbergasted, and it's true because it's a $700 million contract across 10 years with a never before Yeah, and, and, and I'm just, I'm just going to come in and and say this right now because I think it's important. There are people in baseball who are saying this is the team friendliest contract of all time. Now, it's a weird thing to say that somebody is getting $700 million in the end, but it could be team friendly. But when you defer the money for that long, that is the consequence of that. Yeah, absolutely. And at the end, it takes two to tango and Shohei Otani is putting his dancing shoes on. Jeff Fasten with That's the latest he here on SportsCenter. Thank you. With Otani deferring, as we said, $680 million of his $700 million contract, he joins some other notable players who have deferred money in some of their contracts. Some of those notable names include Max Scherzer, Manny Ramirez, and Freddie Freeman. I would love to see Jeff dance.